Today in our 2013 Honda Accord, we'll be looking at our best trailer wiring options. Now these wiring harnesses that we have here today are for Honda Accord coupes and sedans that do not have LED taillights. If you have LED taillights, we have several different options available for you on our website. Also, if you have an Accord Cross Tour, we have different wiring harnesses available for you as well. Okay, we have three options here. This one is our Takancha T1, part number 118596. This is our Kurt T Connect, part number C56011. And then we have our Hopkins plug-in simple wiring harness, part number HM1114365. The first biggest difference that we found between our three wiring harnesses is when it comes down to construction quality. Our Takancha wiring harness here is different than the other two. Our converter box here, the back side where the wires go into, is sealed very nicely with a silicone style sealant to help prevent any moisture from getting inside, causing potential damage to the circuitry. This will make our wiring harness last a very long time and provide us trouble-free service with operating our trailer lights. Our Kurt and our Hopkins wiring harnesses, they don't have that sort of feature. These are actually two-piece boxes that are glued together to form our module. You can see the seam running down the center of both of these. This is a potential way for moisture to get inside, and you could possibly have an issue with one of these. It's not likely, though, since the modules on these wiring harnesses are stored inside the trunk of the vehicle. But the one-piece design that we have on the Takancha makes it a more well-engineered unit. The next biggest difference that we found between our wiring harness is in regards to ease of install. Both our Takancha wiring harness and our Hopkins wiring harness will be required to be hooked up directly to our vehicle's battery using the included rolls of wire and the included fuse holders in order to power our modules. Our Kurt, however, does not require a connection to our vehicle's battery. It runs directly off of our tail light and our turn signal connection points, getting its power directly from the vehicle's wiring itself. This will make for an easier install and save you the time necessary in order to install it. As far as similarities go, all three of these wiring harnesses will get the job done for you. They will allow you to tow a trailer safely and legally with your cord, giving you the necessary lighting functions required by law, such as your tail lights, your turn signals, your brake lights, and your running lights. All three of these wiring harnesses plug directly in line with your vehicle's tail light and turn signal connections with no cutting or splicing required. These three wiring harnesses supply enough power to our trailer's lighting to be able to tow a small trailer with a few incandescent light bulbs or multiple LED lights. We'll have all the necessary items we need with these wiring harnesses in order to provide ourselves a clean installation. We'll have our double-sided tape to mount our modules and several zip ties with each one to secure our wiring. Now all three of our wiring harnesses are very easy to use. They all will store in your spare tire compartment and when we're ready to use them, we simply pull them out, drape them over our threshold, making sure we avoid our trunk latch so when we close the trunk down over the wires, they won't get pinched and damaged. And then we have an adequate length of wire to hook up to our trailer. Now for a brief summary, as far as construction quality goes, we found the Takancha wiring harness to be the better option here because it's well engineered and better sealed converter box will help better protect our vehicle's wiring from the trailer in case of a short. As far as ease of install goes, we found the Kurt wiring harness to be the winner here because we don't have to worry about running an additional wire directly to our vehicle's battery, thus saving us time. And that completes our look at the best trailer wiring options for the Honda Accord. We hope you find this video helpful and informative in your wire. Thanks for watching. Click the link in our description below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com. And leave us a comment if you have any questions.